Well, this evening we are already seeing local reaction in terms of our local politicians to the school shooting. Crime 2's Amanda Rowley is joining us live now here in the studio with more on what Washington leaders and other agencies are saying in support of those Uvalde families. Yeah, that's right. The support for Uvalde families is widespread. In fact, new at six tonight, both Washington and Idaho governors are reacting to this horrific shooting in Texas. Governor Brad Little tweeted this evening, our country is grieving the victims of today's horrific school shooting in Texas. As a grandpa of school age children, this news is heartbreaking. The families and all those affected will be strengthened by our prayers as they cope with this awful tragedy. And Washington Governor Jay Inslee tweeted this afternoon, this cannot be what normal looks like in America. Trudy and I are devastated with the news of yet another violent tragedy. Our hearts are with the victims families and community of Uvalde. Now, on in just the last hour, Washington State Superintendent Chris Rechdahl released a statement on the shooting tonight as well. He says, in part, I will pray for the families who lost their children today and will pray that every parent, guardian, and grandparent in our nation will make the impactful decision to remove or secure deadly firearms within their home. There is simply no debate. Our homes are safer when there are no guns inside them. And tonight, Washington's congressional leaders are also offering their support to the community there in Texas. Congresswoman Kathy McMorris Rogers posted a series of tweets about the shooting, and she says her heart is with the families and entire community. She adds schools must be a safe place for learning and for children to reach their full potential. Washington Senator Patty Murray is also responding to this shooting in a statement. She says children gunned down in their classrooms, lives cut short and families shattered. How many more lives have to be lost and how much more heartbreak must we suffer before my Republican colleagues wake up to what the majority of Americans have known for years? Gun safety laws save lives. And the Pullman Police Department tweeted a photo with a heart around Uvalde. The tweet says we extend our heartfelt sympathies to the Uvalde, Texas community in the wake of today's tragic shooting. Our hearts are with the students, school staff, family, friends and first responders whose lives are forever changed by this devastating act. Now atta attached to these social media posts are even more comments coming in from people here in the Inland Northwest. Many are sharing their own heartfelt words of support and using the hashtag Stay Strong Texas. Amanda Roldy, Krem 2 News.